All right, part one of the video. I do have my wide angle on, so it might might skew things a little bit. Um, anyway, I got a little rug here if you want it comes with it. Um, this wire, so we'll start with this. This wire works. Uh, sometimes, if it doesn't feel like it's getting power here, it will, well I should just save this until you get in here, but you just have to like check this and push it, and then this part. <laughs> I said grandpa didn't fix but um it works it's just sometimes i'm gonna wrap it in some electrical tape and make sure it's a little stiff it's like a position and then it'll be on it'll be working fine and a little storage on the back end here i do have a lock for that or a key for that so you can there's leveling shims in there some gasoline some other stuff um i'll go up top there in a second this is the step where's the step step i was telling you about <laughs> looks like uh, at some point he took off I just used this thing you can see right there to get in but it looks like at some point he took off and bent it I'm sure it would come down if you found a way to I just I've always had this thing so I use this to get in and um, I think at the same time he scraped that he lost a tail light or a side light there not a tail light but a Reflector. I believe that light works. It's just missing its shell. Sure, LP gas in there. That works fine. Whew, tone this down. Let's see here. Anything else? Anything else? Uh, I think like right here, there's like minor pullout of show you. weather stripping. It doesn't leak. It just pulled out, I guess. Um, I do have a locking gas can so nobody or gas caps so nobody steals your stuff. I do have a key for that. Um, up front here, nothing much. I mean, it, that doesn't look good, but it doesn't leak, so never been an issue. Um, this is the other one. This this looks like this, but it still it doesn't leak. I don't. I've never gotten wet. Never seen any issue on the inside. So it's like kind of cosmetic, which I think I think the reason is because I think Grandpa went in there and sealed it right here with. Uh, I think. Someone told me with the heat gun, some guy came and looked at it and said with the heat gun it would pull back out. I don't know, I've never done it because I've never needed to. It's served its purpose. Um, let's see. That's it from the front. I guess there's nothing really up there that I need to mention or talk about. And the rest of it's all good over here. I can't think of any notable pieces to talk about. This is one of those handles you actually have to hold when you lock, so you go like this and old school. If you were to just shut it, it actually doesn't lock, it just... <laughs> and... Oh, well, there is a light out right there too. I don't know how that ended up missing, but that popped off at some point. Other than that, it's the outside. Um, no other things I can really think about there. I'm gonna go inside. Oh, maybe I'll go up top here. Uh. All right, turn this down up top. I mean, it doesn't have an awning. It, uh, it looks like he's had, I don't know, some share of sealant or something. It doesn't leak, so I guess it's not an issue. I mean, it, it's totally dry, it's totally fine. I'll show you the riff on the inside, it's totally fine. So I guess whatever may have, may have been done up here at one point with any of this kind of like patching looking stuff, it worked or maybe it didn't need to be done, I don't know. Anyway, it's kind of a non-issue there. Um, that's the roof. I don't know what that is. Some exhaust or something? Anyway, we'll go inside.